February, Sepulveda Casino Resort will have you jumping for joy. When you play, leave it to luxury. Win your share of up to $432,000 in cash and prizes every Friday and Saturday. And on February 24th, you could drive home a 2024 Audi S5 Cabriolet. Earn entries daily with your Sepulveda Rewards card. And make this a leap year to remember when you leap into luxury. Sepulveda Casino Resort. Diamonds at historic lows. Half carat solitaires, two ninety nine. One carat, five ninety nine. Two carat, fourteen ninety. Our lowest price ever. One carat studs, three forty nine. Thousands of GIA diamonds guaranteed the lowest price set while you watch the Jewelry Exchange Tustin. I'm John Morgan. If you've been injured in a car accident, call Pound Wall from your cell phone. Morgan and Morgan, Pound Wall. That's all. Updated weather all morning. Southern California's weather leader. Live from ABC7, this is Eyewitness News. A helicopter carrying six people crashes overnight in a remote area near the California-Nevada border. There were no survivors, and investigators now searching for clues into what went wrong. Hello, and thank you for joining us. You're watching Eyewitness News at 4, live on ABC7, Hulu Live, and wherever you stream. I'm Joey Rand. Michelle's off today. We begin with that helicopter crash, and of the six victims, one has now been identified as the CEO of a major Nigerian bank. We're now awaiting a press conference from the National Transportation Safety Board. Let's get right to reporter Leanne Souter live in our newsroom with what we know now. Leanne? And Jory, the helicopter was headed from Palm Springs to Boulder City, Nevada last night when it went down. That Boulder City is about 26 miles outside of Las Vegas, home to tomorrow's Super Bowl. It's unknown if that was where the passengers were ultimately headed. We do know that one of the victims, as you said, was the CEO of a major Nigerian bank. Now, the crash happened around 8.45 last night east of the 15 freeway near Hollywood Springs Road outside Baker in San Bernardino County. Now, this is 